The battle of Alabama quarterbacks came down to defenses making big plays, and it was the Miami Dolphins who came up with the biggest and the latest to secure an opening day victory at New England. Cornerback Xavier Howard forced and recovered a fumble inside the Miami 10-yard line with 3.31 left in the fourth quarter and the Dolphins held on for 17-16 victory at Gillette Stadium. The Dolphins' takeaway came after Tua Tungavailoa threw his first interception of the season when he threw the ball downfield to avoid a sack and was picked off by cornerback Jonathan Jones. The turnover gave the Patriots the ball at midfield and they moved the ball to a first and 10 from the Miami 11 before Damian Harris fumbled. Tungavailoa ran for a touchdown and passed for another, a three-yard connection with former Alabama teammate Jalen Waddell to give Miami a 17-10 lead early in the third quarter. New England quarterback Mac Jones, who succeeded Tungavailoa at Alabama, passed for 281 yards and one touchdown, but couldn't help the Patriots do better than scoring one touchdown on four trips inside the 20. Tungavailoa finished 16 for 27 for 202 yards with one touchdown and one interception. The Dolphins were able to win despite New England having significant advantages in total yards, 393 to 258, time of possession. 36 to 43 minus 23 to 17 and third down conversions 11 to 16 to 4 to 11 the dolphins offense couldn't have gotten to a better start putting together a magnificent opening drive it covered 80 yards in 10 plays and ended with tunga vailoa's three yard touchdown run when the new england defense bit on a fake handoff and gave the quarterback an uncontested path to the end zone the fun began with a 17-yard completion from Tua to Waddle and the drive also featured an 18-yard completion to running back Salvan Ahmed out of the backfield. The Dolphins had an important to a big lead early after Zach Sealer recovered a fumble by rookie Ramondre Stevenson that was caused by safety Eric Rowe around midfield, but a third down sack ended the drive. New England scored the next 10 points first on a 27-yard field goal by Folk that was followed by a touchdown pass from Jones to wide receiver Nelson Aguilar. The Dolphins tied the score on the final play of the first half when Jason Sanders kicked a 48-yard field goal to cap a drive that began with a 36-yard completion from Tua to Waddle. The Dolphins had another brilliant drive to start the second half, going 75 yards in nine plays. The big play on the drive was a 30-yard completion on an early third and eight. The drive also featured a 15-yard run by Miles Gaskin. After taking that 17-10 lead, the Dolphins turned to their defense, which did a lot of bending but didn't break. And the result was a big victory that left the Dolphins as the only AFC East team with a 1-0 record after the Bills and Jets lost during the 1 p.m. games.